This is just too weird. You're weird. Barry, is all this really coming out of my head? That's just the way this place is, Al. All that random stuff in your head? Imagination can be anything. But you're from my imagination. Yeah, yeah. You know what, Al? Do yourself a favor and don't pursue that train of thought any further. You see that guy? That guy's gonna kill you. You don't run. Oh goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay. Time out. <laughs> You're braver. All right. Thank you. Dang, Alan. Let's go. All right. There we go. Made it. Okay. You need to get that door open before you can get into the warehouse. That's the way forward. If I'm making this up, why is it so complicated? Because you're a complicated man, and no one Shut understands you. Mouth. But I'm talking... Barry. <laughs> no one asks you, Barry. Good. Like breaks. Alright, get in this car. Good, it's all good. All right.
That bad thing outside is not gonna get us. We're inside. Too. I thought this was my side of the bed. That's it? My side of the bed? What are you talking about, Alice? Can't really talk to you now since I'm stuck here. Well, I guess it was worth it. Hopefully I can get out of here. Then again, maybe I won't. How am I gonna get there? It's all, it's all water. Or, yeah, get under here. He entered the trap. Surrounded by enemies, we get nowhere to run. I'm so sick of you. I can't see. Hey, Flare. Who's that big guy? I don't know. I don't even want to know. Let's just get up before he gets me. You hear him? You hear him? Yeah. Good luck trying to climb up that ladder, sir. Heavy duty lantern? What is this? That's new. Give me that. Oh my goodness. This is the biggest flash I've ever seen. Alright, cool. Sound, is it? No. No, it isn't. Oh, great. Chainsaw Massacre, huh? Uh, let me just see if there's... There's nothing here. Okay. Yeah, I hear him. That's where I got my flare ready to go. Hopefully I can find this little... Sneaky little... Chainsaw Man. He sounds like he's getting louder. I think he's right there. Yep. <laughs> Oh, come on, man. That was flat right there. No. Oh, I don't flare gun. Damn, two shots right in the stomach. He freaking did it. Got face. Well, good thing. Good thing. Third time to charm, right? Right box. Give me that. All these batteries, I don't need these batteries. I already have plenty of batteries. Nothing. Okay. Just keep on going. Keep on trucking. Guys, ready to get rocked? Got a good old sh boomstick. Oh, that's pathetic. There. Oh, nice. Where did that come from? Even really there. Well, my allergies are definitely. See? Allergies. Yeah, but they don't exist, man. You're just in my imagination. Are you kidding me? There you go. That was pretty good. 
chain reaction there. Alright, cool. Another memory. Nice. Yeah, that was gonna hurt a lot. Damn. Okay. Bridge. Memory. <laughs> Stop it! They're waiting for us downstairs. We don't have time for Alan. I knew she wasn't really here, but she still made my heart ache. I had saved Alice, but I wasn't even sure when that happened. Was it days ago? Weeks? Longer? I had no way of knowing. Yeah, we don't know, Alan. Oh, hey. Is that Nightingale? No. Alan awake. The nitrophobic beauty with a muse. Artifact booty. <laughs> the sneezing voices in a sneezing crisis. The renowned and award winning photographer, new coffee table book features coffee table. Features intensely personal and intimate image from a <laughs> life haunted by a husband who was never there. Writer views pre order accepted now. What? A table? Having a love relationship? Come on, Alan. Even for me, that's, that's a kind of a weird book that you should write. Stand clear. Here we go. It's not that bad. Come on. I got this. I got this. Just come back. Oh, that's what they meant. Okay. Alright. Are you ready to run, Alan? I don't think so. I don't freaking think so. But let's go. Bucket, man. Bucket. Let's go. Just pretend that there's a big darkness guy right behind you. It's gonna freaking pulverize you. There you go. Crazy day. Can I swim? I probably can't swim. Oh, great. Hey, guys. Oh, every time. Every time. Why don't you charge at me? Who do you think you are? Try to charge at me. There's something here. Man, every time, dude, I was gonna I was gonna just go and deploy it. I thought they would, they would get phased, but man, they didn't even get phased from that. Oh cool, another memory. Hey, lover. Come here. I've got something for you. I could only hope that Alice was alright. I didn't know what happened to her after she left the dark place. Oh, you know what she's doing? She's probably writing the, the story right now, but it's poorly written. <laughs> because she's not a writer. It's probably... She's trying to get us out of here, but... You know, it's, it's pretty bad. What, what's that? Zane? Is that you? He didn't call us, so maybe that's not... Is that? Who are you? Oh, let's find out. Here we go. Uh, uh, Photo shoot. Hey, hold that pose. That was a good one. Like this? Yeah, but smile a little more. No, that's too much. You want to look mysterious? You need a little tough. You know how people go for those dangerous bad boys. But I'm not dangerous. Oh come on! You write about terrible things all the time. People want to think that you're intimately familiar with them. You kill Casey in this book. You need to look a little bit like a murderer. Oh, that's good. Do that again. You look handsome. And dangerous. You know, I wasn't sure about the beard before, but I was wrong. It looks good on you. Okay, I think we're done. Great. I want to get out of this suit. Hey, things are looking up. <laughs> Guess danger is sexy. <laughs> that was when I was still working. When I felt like a real writer instead of a fraud. It was a good memory. I wished I hadn't seen it. I know, Alan. But don't worry. We're gonna keep pushing. Let's breach. Anyone here? I hear a clock. I hear a ticking. Why are you ticking, my man? What is this? I 
I hear you, Thomas. I just need to find a cockroach. There it is. Little rascal. What is that, three in the entire game? I probably missed like seven right now. <laughs> Alright, put out this flare. Zane, where the hell are you? Alan, you made it. This area of the dark place is calmer, at least for the time being. We can talk here, but we don't have much time. Zane, how do I get out of here? That's what you face. That's you, even as we speak. Darkness. Darkness coming! Swept him away. Lost! He knew. He knew! He couldn't hold on. He knew there was no way out. Oh. No! I'm right here, oh, Zane! Going wrong. That's not me, it's just... Wrong. I don't know, an echo, a hallucination, the Dark Presence. No, the Dark Presence is not responsible for this. You are making this happen. You're trapped in your own nightmares. You are fighting yourself. So how do I not fight myself? Wake didn't understand it. He would never make it. He would never wake up. He'd get swallowed up in the rising tide of darkness. It was coming. It was coming. Shut up! Ah! No! Alan, you must be. Swept away by the gathering insanity. Zane was gone. Wake could feel the pressure gnawing at his mind. The darkness wasn't so bad. It was in him. He felt it. He knew the voice spoke the truth. It was just too hard to think. He can't. Couldn't make sense of it. Couldn't. He wanted to go with the flow. Stop thinking and just let go. Thanks, Alan. You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of this one game called like, uh, oh yeah, Persona. Kind of reminds me of it, not much of it, but it's just like, you know, you gotta fight yourself and then, you know, you said, oh, that's not me, which is you, yes, and it's you, but you just don't want to admit it. So, hopefully, you can just come with terms with yourself and just say, Alan, crap. Alan, this is you, man, you just gotta accept it. You just gotta, not brace the darkness, but just like, you know, like, the voice that is, I mean, that's you. Oh my god, how is that killing me now? Yeah, this thing's good. Give me a sec, I'm dying here. Yep. Good, that's good, that's good. The scope of this horror was unmatched. Oh, I knew it. I ran out of room, like, I couldn't get any cover. But, uh,. But yeah, so, it's kind of like Persona, I guess. It's just like, he needs to come with turns, man. You just need to come with turns. That's it. Uh, Alright. when I need it, man. Stop auto aiming.
hell did that hurt me? I have no idea. Look at all this mess, man. Shouldn't say the flare gun. Oh well. Oh, it's over now, TV. You're done. Just get some more batteries. Again, not the bugs, not the bugs, not the bugs. Oh man, this freaking battery's not gonna last. Oh. To be continued. See, guys, oh my goodness, that is crazy. End of special feature one. Alright. But, uh, like I was saying, yeah, it was like. He needs to, he needs to, like, you know, know that it's him. You know, he needs to embrace himself, his personality. But, uh, hopefully we can figure, figure that out in the second special feature. But, man, I just wonder how Alan's gonna figure this out. All those words that was coming out and. All those memories he had, and I just wonder how Alice is doing, you know? It's just like, he's still trapped in there, and he's probably still underwater, but, you know, we don't know how long it's he's there. Weeks? Months? Because when they lost Alice, then it was just like, you know, it's been a week when they disappeared. So, I don't even know, but hopefully you guys like this uh, Let's Play, guys. And hopefully we can get to the second special feature, and I hope you guys like this Let's Play, and I'll see you guys next time.